gears now to business news. My name is Wairimu Jenga. Now, Kenya spent 210 billion shillings more than it had between July 2023 and March this year on account of a shortfall in revenue collection, non alignment of exchequer issues, and increased expenditure on travel by government agencies. The latest controller of budget report indicates that most of the cash was spent on recurrent expenses at 2.54 trillion shillings with 369 billion shillings going to development expenditure. The top three spenders on development were the State Department for Roads, the State Department for Economic Planning and the State Department for Water and Sanitation. On the other hand, the top three spending government agencies on recurrent expenditure were the Teachers' Service Commission, Ministry of Defence and the State Department for Higher Education and Research. Each spending more than 1 billion shillings during the nine-month period to March 2024. The latest control of budget report indicates that government agencies spent 436.18 billion shillings on compensation to employees, representing 38% of the gross recurrent expenditure. In addition, the total expenditure on travel by employees working for government agencies totaled 18.18 billion shillings, comprising 12.33 billion shillings and 5.85 billion shillings for domestic and foreign travel, respectively. According to the control of budget, this represents a 29.2% increase when compared to what was spent on travel during a similar period in the last financial year. To address this, the control of budget recommends strict compliance with government guidelines relating to non-core expenses, including domestic and foreign travel. The control of budget is recommending the fast tracking of the implementation of the single treasury account that was approved for introduction in January this year. This would ensure the government utilizes its funds to address shortfalls in areas of need. The control of budget says this will help address overdraft charges that increased by 105% to 7.03 billion shillings during the nine months period to March 2024. Trevor Nendo for Prime Edition.